Hello, fluffy people of the world. My name is Liquid Blitz, and welcome back to... Uh, hang on, where's my fucking cursor? Why have I got... Hang on. Do you not usually have a cursor on this screen, or am I, am I going crazy? Welcome back to Resident Evil 4, episode 13 or whatever. We are where we left off last time, obviously. Um, it's been a few days since I recorded, um, so I'm sort of still fresh. Now, prior to recording, I've set everything up. I've done all the inventory shit. Um, I have just briefly, and I'm talking seconds ago, gone back through the recent comments of episodes 11 and 12. So I've got recent, for once, I've got recent up-to-date tips. And uh, a couple of people agreed the scopes for the rifle are irrelevant um, as soon as you get the, um, the thermal scope. So I'm actually going to sell the previous scope, get some inventory space. Um... And also, what are you selling? I'll tell you what I'm selling. I'm selling scope rifle. I think that's it. Yeah, it's five thousand. It's worth it. <laughs> now, something else I'm Thank selling. You. I did ask about the eyes. I've got like seventeen green eyes, etc. Apparently, there's only two um, valuables that require eyes: two butterfly lamps, and once you've done those you can sell the rest now i don't remember having two butterfly lamps i only remember one so i'm gonna keep one of each um but other than that i can sell everything else is that all <laughs> so i'm gonna have some thank good you. money after this is that all strength <laughs> yeah. thank you thank you right i've got one of each just remaining it's it's not worth that much um the incomplete golden links what else what now, I've been getting conflicting shit about different weapons uh, in the comments since I started this playthrough. I, I guess it all comes down to preference, but one thing has become clear to me, and it's, it, it's something that's not necessarily clear as a blind let's play. All the weapons tend to swing on what they're... Once you've, it, it turns out, I mean, you're not to know this is a blind Let's Play, but all the weapons, once once they're fully upgraded, seem to have exclusive special abilities, or, you know, they're just, they have an overpowered effect once you fully upgrade them. And I believe that's every single weapon, and it's a unique effect. So, naturally, I don't know what the unique effects of all the guns are. But, um, for example... A couple of people suggest um, the basic handgun you start with is actually the best once it's fully upgraded. And another thing I had a question about was saving up for the Killer 7. Because it seems to be a more powerful version of the Broken Butterfly. Because this is almost fully upgraded, 24 damage. This Killer 7 isn't upgraded at all. And it's 25. It's, it's more damage. But people have said that once you get the exclusive effect for this, it's better than the Killer 7. So I think the Killer 7 might be one situation where I'm not going to try out the weapon. Because, I mean, li literally just going off the look of it, you, I'm covering half the um, the picture, but you can still see the gun. I love revolvers, just just quintessential revolvers, and because people have said the the fully upgraded ability of this gun is actually better than the Killer Seven, I'm gonna keep this. Oh, so yeah, I'm actually I think I'm not gonna get the Killer Seven. Um, I'm gonna keep upgrading Broken Butterfly. Now, speaking of tuning shit up. Some people have said the Riot Shotgun is actually the best. I'm going to stick with the Striker, I've decided. And the only thing left on this is Capacity. I've got five upgrades to do. Um, but I, And I think it goes up to 100 mag size. So I'm going to fully upgrade that. I want to upgr fully upgrade this. Um, so Shotgun, I want to fully upgrade Revolver. And I want to fully upgrade Rifle. Um, so that's three I want to 100% fully upgrade. Not as bothered about the others. I'm sure they've got awesome effects once you um, max them out. Um, but I can't max everything out. Um, anyway, enough grab assing. Let's get back to it. The last thing that happened at the end of the last episode was Ashley got mind controlled by Lord Assface and, uh, and she's gone with him. And Le I remember Leon whipped out a, a transmitter um, location little thing, shot Ashley in the back with it. He pulled it out of thin fucking air. It's like Leon has no end to the gadgets that we don't know about yet in his little tool belt. 
And we're just, I guess, following her. And it looks like she's there. Ooh, right, okay. I've missed playing this. It's been like four days for some reason. Um, I did just see a shiny thing, didn't I? Did I just loot something? I swear to God I saw a little shiny thing when I walked in here. I guess not. I guess not. My memory is shit. I'm, I, seriously, I'm starting to get worried about my real life memory here. Because I'll do a thing and then I'll have no memory of doing that thing. Anyway, let's continue. Hmm. Oh, cutscene straight away. What's the news on our friend Leon? Is this Krauser? Easy. The sample? Sadler's got it. It seems he sniffed out our little game. Oh shit, man. Perfect. Scarface? Just so we understand each other clearly, I don't trust you, nor does Wesker. If you try to do anything clever, I will kill you. Huh. Is that so? You know, I met Wesker long before you. We'll see soon enough if you did. Oh. Yeah, we'll see. Huh. Okay, so Krauser is working for Wesker. We've only seen Krauser once before, and he was, like, um, serving uh, or, or working for Lord Sadler. Out of nowhere, we learn he's actually working for Wesker. And maybe he's, like, undercover us or some shit. Checking on Lord Sadler, checking what's going on with the Plagas and all this shit. So him and Ada are on the same side, but don't trust each other. Because Ada is secretly awesome, and she's helping me. Hello? Hello? Where's he gonna run from? Oh. Is it all connected? Another thing about upgrading, you know how you, the, the magazine fills up when you upgrade? The magazine of the fully upgraded shotgun I'm using is apparently 100 rounds, so that's a lot of free ammunition. That's a lot of free ammunition. Um, let's keep going. That, I'm, I'm, my eyes are on that treasure. We'll, we'll just keep going. There's no treasures in the next couple of rooms. Oh! Fuck. Um. Oh, another tip people have given me. I love the fucking tips. It's one of the best parts about recording these games blind for YouTube. I get tips back. A tip is the mine thrower. Shoot the mine on enemies because it sticks. Now, I knew that. I've, I think I've done that once or twice. But I prefer to shoot a spot on the ground just so I had control of the location and all the enemies around it rather than putting it on one enemy. Because then he might run away from the group of enemies, you know? Super <gasps> That's the first time- Oh god! Where did he come from? Oh my god, googly eyes, googly eyes. Uh, another tip, we're full of tips today. Another tip is um, the googly eyes are insta-killed, instantly killed by flashbangs. And I, did, I didn't know that. So any, whenever there's like a group of googly eyes, I'll just flashbang. Um, that was the first time I've pulled off this legendary suplex I've been hearing about. And I would like to say, it's not my fault that it's taken me that long to do a suplex. Um, that was great. It just annihilates their head. But, uh, yeah, I wouldn't have known about the suplex had people not commented on it. How I haven't, like, people were shocked that I haven't managed to pull off a suplex yet, and I didn't even know what that was. Because how many times, how many times have I stumbled a villager or an enemy? What's that sound? How many times have I, like, stumbled an enemy, run up to kick them, and just kick them? I've never, I've never seen the suplex prompt until then. Um, and apparently you've got to get them to their knees, but I swear to God, I've got enemies to their knees before and ran up point blank, and I've got still got the kick prompt, not the suplex prompt, so... Maybe historically I've always left it a bit too long and they start to get back up, which is why I get the kick prompt, perhaps. But I'm gonna, I am gonna suplex some more motherfuckers. <gasps> Fuck! 
I need him to stumble though. All of a sudden, I'm getting s for shit. Oh, come on, man! Another person f throwing round a corner. Back off, back off. Damn it. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck off, man. What'd you, what'd you fuck off? I want to suplex every si- Fucking hell. Oh my god. Oh, 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 oh. Jesus. You see, he was like vaguely on his knees and I got the kick prompt. I wonder if you're just gonna get right- Shit. I wonder if you're gonna get really close to them. And that's the difference. Shit! Ow! Fuck! Oh, I got it, but I didn't hit it. What's going on with my aim? I can't aim upwards. I wonder if I can, like, suplex these guys. Even with the, the googly eyes. Yes! Is it dead? Oh, that's a good way of killing the googly eyes. If I don't, don't want to use flashbangs. I'm liking the, the, the meta of like stumbling them with leg shots though. <laughs> why? why? I, I'm confused at how I haven't seen a suplex prompt before now. I'm really confused. Now it's nothing but... I, I must have run up to enemies on their knees before. I must have. Hey. Speaking of googly eyes. More flashbangs. It's a shame the googly eyes only like sprout once you've injured an, injured an enemy. Um... Because I want to flashbang multiple googly eyes. Suplex, suplex, sir! <laughs> yes. That's all I'm going to be doing. Somebody in the comments, please let me know why I haven't seen the suplex until now. It's, it probably is the reason I gave. I probably just have always left it a bit too long and they've started to get back up again. But I just don't get how I've never seen it as a prompt. I've run up to so many enemies I've stumbled. Some of them are like, you know, grabbing their face and that's the, that gives you the kick. But some, many of them have been on their knees as well, so I don't get it. It's like Leon has, has just learned to do it and now I'm getting the prompt every single fucking time. Oh, look at this place. Ooh. That this looks like a place that would have some dogs in it. I don't know why. I'm getting memories of like Resident Evil 3 and wolves in parking lots for some reason. Uh, now, am I in the room with the treasure? No, I'm fucking miles away. Okay. So it looks like we're going to be fighting Krauser soon. And then we're going to run into Ada afterwards. Um, maybe Ada will help us against Krauser. Huh. Krauser? I received a minor spoiler about the Krauser fight. Which is kind of upsetting, but it's... Oh, it, 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 this is exactly that. It's the Krauser fight. I... I pressed the keys. You... I pressed the fucking keys. I don't care what this game says. You probably heard me mash the buttons then. Oh, I suck. <laughs> right, I should, while I, while I know it's about to happen. I did receive a minor spoiler, um, and it was one of the, it was one of those moments where it was spoiled by, um, 
it's, it's not a spoiler as such. It's, it's okay. It's one of those like moments where I got a, there was a comment about the coming Krauser fight, and it was what I consider a minor spoiler, but it was one of those things that many people don't consider spoilers, and that's why they said it. You know what I mean? I'm very, very sensitive to spoilers, and and, and there's 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 some people who don't realize they're spoiling something. Do you know what I mean? And and the person in question even defended themselves saying it wasn't a spoiler and then, and and it's like i'm sorry but that's not for you to decide you know the, the the spoiler was it's not a big story spoiler so it's not a major spoiler but it's simply what um it's what okay they said basically in this coming fight to use the knife because you can kill him apparently you can kill krauser very very easily and quickly just but with knife attacks and somebody then responded to that comment saying, a, a blind Let's Player has no way to know that. That's a spoiler, etc. And then I agreed with him. Yes, it kind of is. Apparently, it's just way easier, this fight with a knife. Now, I'm not going to do that because as, um, as the replier noted, uh, uh, somebody who's playing this game for the first time, completely blind, has no way of knowing knife attacks would work. And they said, no sane player who's never played this game before, no sane player would try to use a knife on him because it's mental. Do you know what I mean? It's the sort of thing that only a lot of knowledge about the game would reveal. That's why it's a spoiler. But the person who commented that doesn't think so and disagreed. And then tried to sort of defend himself that it wasn't a spoiler. And there's nothing... There's nothing worse than... You know... Someone who spoiled something minor, then trying to argue that it's not a spoiler when it it's not for the spoiler to decide if it's a, if it's spoiled. Dodged, motherfucker. Kind of, kind of dodged. This guy just supermaned from the rafters. Oh, comrade. Krauser. I died in the crash two years ago. Is that what they told you? You're the one who kidnapped Ashley. Oh? Yeah, John Quick, as expected. After all, you and I both know where we come from. Shit! <laughs> I'm sorry. My hand what I, I'm not gonna make any excuses, I suck. I, I really get into the story in the cutscenes. My mouth my hand wasn't even on my mouse. Right, fuck's sake. Fuck's sake. Right, let's do it. Quick, quick, quick. Real fast this time. Real fast. I'm sorry. Pretend the last five minutes hasn't happened. I'm, I'm watching for the prompts like a professional now. One. Been a long time, comrade. So Krauser, am I supposed to know who he is? Krauser. Because I don't. I died in the crash two years ago. Is that what they told you? You're the one who kidnapped Ashley. You got John Quick, as expected. After Fire. all, you and I both know where we come from. I'm watching for the prompts. <laughs> Jesus. What do you want? <laughs> Dodged. The sample Saddler developed, that's all. Okay. I, I'm having to pay attention to, like, several things at once. Leave Ashley out of this! Oh, I needed her to buy Saddler's trust in me. Like you, I'm American. Well, this is being, like, posed as a knife fight, to be fair. So maybe it's not that much of a spoiler. This you is... got her involved just for that? Ugh. Jesus. Krauser definitely has the advantage with, like, muscles. Kra he's, this guy's built like a brick shithouse. Although he's, he's missing all his attacks, because now I'm paying motherfucking attention. Although Leon is still getting his ass kicked, and he's dropped his weapon. All for Umbrella's sake. Umbrella? Almost let it slip. Enough talk. Well, Die, yeah. comrade. So he's working for Umbrella. Well, we know he's working for Wesker. Oh, Ada? Somebody shot. Ada! Ada, yes! Well, if it isn't the 
bitch in the red dress. There you go. She Let's was good after all. <laughs> what the fuck? Art? You may be able to prolong your life, but it's not like you can escape your inevitable death, is it? Fucking hell, this guy didn't skip leg day. He just did like a two, a, tw a 20,000 inch vertical leap. What you the fuck? Knew each other? More or less. Yeah, how do they know Maybe each other? Maybe time you told me the reason why you're here. Maybe some other time. She just openly betrayed Wesker, by the way. If they're both working for Wesker and Umbrella and shit. She... Enjoy the reunion with your old friend. A little bit. As a matter of fact, I did. Wonderful. He's got the cut on his cheek. I wouldn't want my special guests on the island feeling unattended. Guess I'm supposed to thank you, right? Ah, I have an idea. What now? Since you're here, why don't I introduce you to it? It? it should keep you busy. It? I can't remember the name, huh? A senior moment, perhaps. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what the fuck is it? What the fuck is it? Let's get my bearings, hang on. We got a ladder there. I think that's where we came from. Let me have, just have a quick look. So yeah, I mean, I don't know if I'm supposed to know who Krauser is at this point in the Resident Evil, like, you know, story, chronologically. Because I've, I've played 1, 2, and 3 of the HD remakes. Now, I know that a lot of shit is cut in the HD remakes compared to the originals. And I will get to the originals, by the way. I'm doing these in a weird order. Um, but I do intend to do the originals. Um, but the only game I've played as Leon is Resident Evil 2 alongside uh, Claire. Um, and there was no Krauser I remember mentioned in any documents or anything, so I guess we're not supposed to know who he is right now? Just somebody from Leon's past? Interesting. And yet Ada came to the rescue because Leon, even with the prompts, being a success, Leon still just got his ass kicked. Although he got a nice slash on Krauser's chest. Oh, fuck. And it's in there. Uh, yeah, this is interesting. I, w I really wanted to pay attention to the dialogue and the story. That's why I fucking play these games. But the super fast ultra pro mode, hard mode prompts. I was only half paying attention to the dialogue. Crowds are... Oh, shit. Um, oh, shit. Oh, shit. Is it coming towards me now? Oh... This is kind of like the movie I see all of a sudden. So yeah, Krauser is the one who kidnapped the president's daughter. Oh! Fucking Jesus. That was my time to go through there. <laughs> Fucking hell, the prompts, man. Jesus. This is very, very cool, though. This is like the closest thing... What the fuck is this? This is like the closest thing to the first movie I've seen in all of Resident Evil so far. Oh, there's gonna be more prompts. Let's just fucking go for it. Oh, ho, ho, Leon! Ooh, he's got the moves! Any more? Turn it off. Make this a safe haven. Um... Well... Oh, fucking hell, Leon! All these characters are suddenly, um... Really acrobatic. Did you see the fucking jump Krauser did? Oh, oh, this is the throne room. Um... Somebody complained, by the way, that I'm wasting... It, it was like a, an old comment from, like, the third episode, but somebody complained that I was wasting healing items. Um, and it is what it is. I want to get back to full health. And they also taught me you can mix three green herbs, which I didn't know. Um, but anyway, enough of that. Shotgun on. Let's approach the throne. Hello? Emerald. Okay, then. Um, rah, I had a feeling <laughs> this was the treasure room. Oh, 
What is it? Is it the last thing for the cat's face? I got the elegant headdress. I think I can just straight up sell that. Cool. Cool. Right. Can I sit down? Why? W I mean, why would you? I want to, but... <laughs> what the fuck is this moment? There's no time for resting. <laughs> okay, um... That might be the thumbnail of this video. Just Leon chilling after a knife fight. Um, okay. Oh, this is getting, like, futuristic. Let me know in the comments how you feel about ult what I would call ultra minor spoilers, like the, like the one I mentioned how somebody um, told me. Basically, the most effective tactic for a coming boss fight. Um, let me know if you think that's a comment or if you disagree uh, and you just think that's a helpful tip. It's it's a fine line, and I, I said that in my reply. How it's very it's very often a very very fine line, and to some people it might be a spoiler, and not to others. M my best tip, if you're worried something might be a spoiler, is just don't say it. Or at least give a big old warning, this might be a spoiler for you, sort of a thing. Because um, I'm going into a coming fight knowing full well that I, I could easily, if I wanted to, I could just use a knife to easily defeat Krauser. And I shouldn't know that. So in my mind, that is a spoiler, but not to, not to other people. Um, Luis is a member of four. I'll report my findings about the Plagas here. The Plagas have three distinct characteristics. One, as mentioned previously, the Plagas have the ability to manipulate the behavioural patterns of their hosts. Okay. The Plagas are social organisms. By this I mean that instead of living individually, they live in a perfect social harmony. It is believed that they have a collective intelligence. This type of behaviour can be seen among insects such as bees and ants. However, this kind of social behaviour is rarely seen among parasitic organisms. Perhaps it was a learned behaviour by the Plagas. I'm finding out if this has any relationship with their first characteristic. 3. The Plagas have exceptional adaptation skills. Hang on. Just make sure I'm actually recording. <laughs> That'd be a shame. Um... Adaptation skills. They are able to live off many kind of kinds of organisms by creating a symbiotic environment quickly. This ability, when combined with their social behaviors, allows them to interact intelligently between hosts, regardless of the host organism. Is that is this going to explain how Lord Sadler is like from a distance, seemingly using Jedi mind powers to control the Plagas? He's he's, he's just. It's just social plaga behavior, you know what I mean? And he he has the, uh, he is controlling the plagas, I guess. So when he made, when he gave Leon pain, or he gave Ashley, like, he sort of controlled her, he's just controlling the plagas with his own plagas, sort of a thing. I am ashamed to admit that my pure fascination with the plagas, in hindsight, has blinded me to the true research objectives of the Los Illuminados. Even with the knowledge that Sadler was going to abuse the results of these experiments, I could not pull myself away from my research. As a result, I am just as responsible for this whole mess as he is. I see now that I was wrong, but can I stop their evil plans alone? Um, yeah, I wonder if he's responsible for, like, contacting the US government to get help? Or if, if Leon was sent just to get the president's daughter back. Nothing to do with Luis. Interesting. Now, before I speak to um, Billy Boy here, anything I should... Oh, hello. Anything else? Okay. Well, let's do all the housekeeping. But yeah, back to my point of the spoiler stuff. At least the, the knife fight with Krauser. Um, I'm, I'm assuming there was a fight with him, not that cutscene, because that's obviously a knife fight. Um, but I will not be using a knife, I've decided, because I, there was no way in hell I would actually use a knife um, fighting him just off my own knowledge, so I'm not going to, even though I've been told it's, it is easier and better. Um, uh, what the fuck is the... There, that's it. I'm still not going to do it, because the, the natural me, having been told nothing, wouldn't use a knife anyway. 
so I'm going to stick to my guns, knowing it's probably a bad idea. Welcome. Any new upgrades? Things on sale. What are you selling? I've got a thing I can sell. That um, headdress, I believe I can just straight up sell those. Ah. <laughs> Thank you. Right. You okay. Oh, fucking... Oh, it's the last damage upgrade. Um, go Is for it. <gasps> fucking hell, that's all my money. Jesus. Um, hang on. Before we do that. Jesus. Like, damn, son. I kind of want to max... I want to max out one weapon first. Um... Because how how many more pesetas am I going to get? I don't reckon I'll, I'll be able to upgrade everything to get the special effect. So I've, I've got to pick and choose. And I reckon the best thing is this. Because it's all finished except capacity. And it'll give me a bunch of shotgun ammo. Um, oh, fuck. I'll tell you what. Damage is so important to me. I've got to at least max the firepower. Okay. Is that all, stranger? Sorry for the loud car, but that's... I've, I'm left with 30,000. <laughs> Thank you. So... I will all, up the capacity as much as I can. <laughs> Is that all? <laughs> that's it. Thank you. That's all I've got. And it's giving me a few extra shotgun rounds. Come back. So... So it gave me like five extra rounds or something. Not bad. Any time. Let's blast a quickie. And the, the spoiler thing with the the knife being the most effective tactic, keep in mind, it's more than just now Now I know the best tactic. I had only seen one cutscene with Krauser for like 20 seconds at, at that point when I read that comment. So I only, I've only briefly caught a glimpse of Krauser. Now, it's pretty obvious that it will be a boss fight, but you never know with these sorts of games. Some, some plot twist might have happened and Krauser might have turned out to be a good guy and helped me actually, undercover or some shit. Or he might have died through some other method, just out of nowhere, like Ada could kill him. Just complete plot twist that you're not expecting. And because the guy um, in the comments let me know about the knife being the best way to defeat him. I now know that yes, we are fighting him. So it might be the obvious thing, but now I know that we are and all other potential mystery is gone. It's like, yes, I know for 100% fact I am having a boss fight with Krauser and I even know the best way to kill him. So in my opinion, um, that is a spoiler. Because, because, you know, in these games it, with cutscenes and, you know, plot twists, it is very possible I wouldn't have fought him, you know? The, these games like to give you the obvious and then twist it around. So, you know, you might be running around thinking, okay, I'm gonna have that, that military Krauser crazy guy about to fight me, and then he just dies. It happens all the time in these sorts of games. And when the mystery is removed, and I know what's going to happen now, it's a bit, I think that's a, that crosses the fine line j just a little bit into the territory of spoiler. Anyway, what the hell is this cage thing? Is this it? Is that what he was talking about? Oh, you know what this looks like. This looks like a boss arena is what this looks like. A ma maze sort of boss arena with it chasing me. Oh, the transmitter. Did it fall off her? It is beeping very loudly. They would be able to tell. <laughs> they would spot that pretty quick. Whatever it is, it's big. It's fucking big. It's horrible. What is the... the, the... No! Mr. Frodo. Hit the button, hit the... <gasps> no choice, no choice. No choice. I've got a choice. I've, I'm, in a, I'm in a fucking corner, man. I'm in a fucking corner, man. It's fast. Okay, it's on my ass. It's on my fucking ass. Um, what is this fight? Oh, fucking hell. What is this? What is... This is it, is what this is. 
this is this is nothing but dead ends. Um, let's try and flash what whatever it is. Is this like a failed experiment or something? Ha! It did nothing. Past it, run past it, run past it. Oh, right. In the face, motherfucker! It won't open, but there's gotta be a way. Okay, okay. Run past it, run past it, run past it. Jesus Christ. What's this way? Okay. Oh, hang on. What's that? Um, can I climb up on top of all this shit? Oh my god, it sounds like it's on me. Is it the same text? Right, I need to climb up somehow. I think I did enough damage to, like, scare it. Maybe that's the point. Um, let's look for a way up or a thing to shoot. Um, okay, right. Um, okay, well, I've damaged it enough to scare it. It. Um... Where is it? Like, like, for real? I can hear it grunting in my ear. Um, well, I think I scared it off. Yay! I won the fight! Um, you can't shoot these fucking things. They're glowing green. I can't actually interact with the, con with the control panel itself. Can I just shoot it? If this works, this is a bunch of bullshit. Because why can't I just use my hand? Eh. What what control? <laughs> what engineering control panel requires a gunshot to operate? One of the switches. Okay, right. Okay, I got it. Got it. It got me. It got me with its tail, with its tail or its face or its dick or its hand or something. Some appendage. I'm fucking. Oh god, I'm, my health is going down. I'm dodging these like a fucking pro, but it's not working. Uh, fast. Uh, uh, and it. Uh, shit, man. Run past it. Run past the motherfucker. Run past the motherfucker. Run past the motherfucker. It was this way. Here. Oh, well, I went and balls that up, didn't I? I've got, like, Olympic seconds to get out here. Um. You know what? Let's, let's do this logically. I do have a map. I didn't see a thing on that door. I need to dodge this motherfucker really fast. Seven seconds, fuck off! Second, 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 second. Fucking hell, that was fast. <gasps> oh my god. What a battleground this is! Like, timed drops. Jesus. Let's, um, let's just heal. Let's throw one of those into one of those. And use a mega heal. Ooh, he's nearly full health. Like, full, full health. Let's just run around. Oh, Jesus Christ. What now? Any prompts? No? Fuck. Run around him. It's a, it's a, I've got to use a shotgun round real fast. One. Okay, okay. Can I dodge his shit? Run around him. Damn it! I tried to get around him. <laughs> go away, go away, leave me alone, fuck off. I'm just wasting shotgun rounds here. I'm fully aware. Um. Oh. I've come back. Okay, this is where I'm going. Around him. There we go. There we go. Done. 
I'm getting ready to dodge. There we go. I've got this. That was very ominous. Is this like Casa Doom? Is there no bottom to this damned cave? Oh, Jesus. I mean, give me a chance. Oh, what the fuck is... Oh, my God. <gasps> okay, he missed. He's shit. He's missed. Where's the... Where's the... Where's the... <sighs> There's no light. Um... Oh, shall I just... Let's just nade him, shall we? Oh, I'm about to get hit. <laughs> Run around him. Where's the green light, though? Is it through here? Bloody hell, man. Oh, I see. Oh, fuck. Run around him. Run around him. I don't even know where he is, man. This is some horrific shit. It was to the right, wasn't it? Around here. Done. I'm just going to literally pretend this monster isn't here. Run around him. Fuck off. Nope. Nope. You don't exist. You are not my concern. I hope he falls. Um, I'll, I'll take the hook. Thank you. <laughs> Goodbye, it. Jesus. That was like an amalgam of like a bunch of different failed experiments. Okay, that wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. You could, so it turns out you could literally run around that thing. <laughs> Look at this though. Jesus. I'm probably going to see that again. I haven't missed a, a treasure ever. No? Okay. Oh, there's a way back. Well, let's check out the cock and balls on the right. Before I go in that door. Oh, shit. Oh, is he already... Bloody hell, man. Oh, he just managed to sneak in. Right, Jesus. Okay, here, here it is. Run away, run away, run away. He's even faster than he was before. Shit. No. I need to... I don't know what good that's going to do me. <gasps> what the fuck good is that? Come at me, bro. Run away! What's the point of these? Like, he's slow enough to sort of run away anyway. That was the way in. Right, so it's just a, it's just a loop. Okay. At least it's not that fast. Like, I can just keep running from this guy. I've got a bunch of SMG rounds, I'll use that. Come at me, dude. Let's just go full ham. And then one away. Jesus Christ. Look at this thing. It's like a it's like a human mixed with a worm, mixed with like two scorpions. Mixed with like a frog. Oh, that's bad. This is not good. <laughs> this is horrible. Um Hmm. Let's do this. Let's buy myself some time. In the head, why not? Back off a little bit. Jesus. I'm kicking this guy's ass. Was that it? You ain't... It's not it. It's not it. I've just pissed it off. Ooh, bloody hell, man. Oh my goodness. This is probably the best you... Let's open. 
Is this motherfucker about to, uh... Oh, shit, man. Why do I keep taking my hand off my mouse? I'm such a dick. Oh, fuck. Is this, is this a question of, oh shit. I think this is just raw damage. It doesn't seem to have any weak, spo uh, weak spots besides his head. Um, like, no obvious shit. Jesus. Oh my god, back off. Back the fuck off. I think I can kill him with conventional weapons. He's faster than, oh god. <laughs> He's got a speed boost. He's picked up like a speed upgrade. Ooh, I can't see his face anymore. We go real fast. Oh, that's just creepy, dude. Get ready to dodge. There we go. Show yourself. Bloody hell. This thing's obsessed! Can you please, like, show yourself? There you go. Right, it might be time for some more firepower. I might take the scope. Oh shit, did that count? Nice. Nice and simple. Ooh, 50,000. Damn. Right, I'm going to upgrade more shotgun um, capacity. That was, Yeah, that wasn't that bad, that fight. The worst part of that was the actual creature itself. A mix of like 40 different animals. Oh, Jesus. That was easy compared to some boss fights. I swear to fuck, in Resident Evil games, so often, regular enemies can be harder than bosses sometimes. That was easy. I just had to, like, run away, get enough distance, and just do raw damage to it. And that was nice and simple compared to, like, some crossbow shooting motherfuckers who just keep hitting you from distance. You know, pesky bastards can be more challenging than that boss was. Ooh, just less horrific. Right, so we've got a way of going back, which is always cool. Although I don't think I need to. Let's keep on going. Submission? I haven't seen a, a submission blue dot for you for a thousand years. Hm. Any lootables? I'm look I am looking forward to fighting Krauser, I must say. And I definitely want to know how Leon knows him. I've got a feeling it's like is it one of those things that's already been referenced or was it revealed in like I know there's a bunch of Resident Evil games on like smaller consoles, like side games almost, and but they are canon. Um so there is a lot of games I will not be able to play because I've only got a PC. Um and I'm wondering if Krauser was in one of those smaller, lesser-known side games of Resident Evil. Right, I'm going to have a lot of fun here. Um, say goodbye to your little lives and to say hello to my little friend. <laughs> I'm sorry I've killed all your friends. Let's go say hello. What's up, dude? I'm sorry that I've ruined your life like this. Suplex? No. No. It'd be cool if you had the uh, option from, like, behind or something. Suplex! Yes! <laughs> Ooh. Okay. The suplex is definitely better than the kick.
I say that, Leon can literally kick heads off, so the kick is pretty badass as well. But the suplex, come on dude, it's a fucking suplex. Money. I'm not surprised I'm starting to get lots of money right now, honestly. With the amount of upgrading to be done. Let me know in the comments if it's possible. Shit, I just... Fuck, I just missed something. Let me know if it's possible to get enough money in one playthrough to upgrade every weapon. Surely that's not possible. Unless, like, enemies can respawn. Um... Like, earlier in the game, you can go back and keep keep killing enemies to get more and more money. Um, oh, ah, there's a treasure under there. Right. I'll get that. Let's go down and get this treasure. I wonder if it's going to be the final gem for the cat's face. And then we're going to be really rolling in the money. Oh, uh, <laughs> speaking of blue stone of trees, and we had the, like the red stone of faith, the green stone of temperance or some shit. Now the blue stone of treason. There you go, we have a complete cat. Cool. I estimate that'll sell for 50,000. Two gems uh, in it. it sold for 25,000, so it's... This is gonna fetch a fine price for my pocketbook. Um, hang on. Was that it? Was that the actual treasure? I think it was. Let's sell this bad boy. Oh, Krause's note. Mm. I did notice he had a, a serpent on his knife, by the way, during the cutscene. Uh, snake bite, it says. Did they... Just knock something over? I'm a fucking idiot. Hang on. I wonder if they, like, train together. Because as far as I'm aware, Leon is... Um, Leon was in the police when all the zombie shit started happening. And then I think that's it's been several years, hasn't it? Like, hasn't it been like five years since then? Now? And Krauser mentioned something two years ago, didn't he, during the cutscene? I've forgotten what already. He may mention, I think, didn't he mention a crash two years ago? So maybe they knew each other, like, after the events of Resident Evil 2, which is where I know Leon from, and before now. So I guess, thinking about it, I wouldn't know Krauser. Because I don't know of anything to do with Leon between now and Resident Evil 2. It turns out that old man Sadler wasn't buying me from the start. Even though I succeeded in kidnapping Ashley, I sort of sensed this when Sadler didn't completely let me in the loop. Right, so he wasn't believing Krauser from the start. Okay. Under the circumstances, I had no other alternative but to call for her assistance. Oh! So Krauser was the one who got Ada involved, it sounds like. Perhaps she knew this was the way it was going to turn out all along. My guess is that her... Ada's ultimate goal might be different from Wesker's and mine. This is just the perfect opportunity to find out. And after I get rid of Leon and retrieve the sample... So he's here for the sample, for Wesker. Translation, Wesker wants the Plaga sample, period. So that's what Wesker and Umbrella are wanting. Ada's, Ada's working for them, but might be working against them. In fact, she just shot Krauser, like, you know... So Ada's just openly rebelled. So so we don't ultimately know who Ada's, Ada's serving or helping, really. It's Wesker, but it might not be Wesker. And after I get rid of Leon and retrieve the sample, I'll put her in a body bag along with Leon and send them both to Wesker. Okay. I like the fact that a Ada is probably the most complex character so far. We've, we've got, like, Leon and Claire and, like, Chris Redfield, and they're, like, clean-cut good guys. Then you got the bad guys, the arseholes, like Wesker and Krauser. And the, the, then you got the mental fucking bad guys like Sadler, etc., who are just crazy. But then you've got the complex characters, and we all know complex characters are the best part of, like, these sorts of games and movies and things. And Ada is right there. She's, she's the most complex character. She's, you don't quite know her intentions. She helps you, so she's got some good 
she's part good, but then she's working for bad guys. It's, it's, it's awesome. Ada's probably my favorite character. She might be my favorite Resident Evil character, actually. It's, it's fucking close with Jill Valentine. Let's save this. I will say, I think Jill Valentine's probably the most badass Resident Evil character. Just because of what she has fucking been through. <laughs> but then, her personality is a bit more abrasive and standoffish than, like, Ada. Even though we don't really know Ada. Ada's, you know... She is more willing to be fun in a speedboat, you know what I'm saying? Whereas uh, Jill Valentine is, is a bit like, Fuck you, I don't need your help. Uh, I'm, you know... She's more. Welcome. She recognizes that she herself is a badass. Rare things on sale. What are you buying? What now? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Right. I might just keep upping. I I want to really nail the shotgun. Three more upgrades. Is that all? <laughs> is that all? <gasps> <gasps> Thank you. This is it. This is the first. Last upgrade <laughs> that I've got in the game so far. This is it. Let's see what happens when we fully upgrade it then. Is that all, stranger? <laughs> ah, you. right. I think it's the exclusive that bumps it up to 100 rounds. So this, and if it is, this is going to give me like 30, uh, 30, fucking 72 shotgun rounds. 60,000. I need to save up for it, but I'm looking forward Come to on. it. Anytime. Right, I didn't know you'd have to buy the exclusive, but it makes sense. I wish it would give you a hint of what the hell the exclusive is before you... It just says exclusive. Anyway. Okay, we've got the firing range here. Um, oh, what am I talking about? I didn't sell the cat. What are you selling? It's not enough, unless it's worth 50 million. But it'll... 35,000. That's, uh, that's over half of what I need. So. Ah, I'll buy it at a high price. Oh, um, hang on, didn't sell it. Ah. <laughs> there. I <laughs> need 13,580. Um, just, a, that's just a couple more enemies, is that? Uh, why is there a ladder here? This ladder is... Hang on, there's a blue thing behind me. Oh, that's just the um, the firing range thing. All good. Where does this go? Sorry if there's been any... Ah, um... oh, right, it's just a, it takes me closer to the... Uh, where we've got to go. Uh, in fact, we had to come this way. Oh, right, let me jump back real quick. I thought all this underground was optional, but it's not. We had to come this way. Mm, yeah, I was going to say, sorry if there's been any skipping or, like, lag in the video. I've noticed um, on my monitor thing, my recording monitor, um, it said there's been a few skipped frames due to encoding lag, so that, that translates to stuttery fucking recording. I apologize if there's been any lag. Oh. I can see a door in the distance. I need to find another way there. Very astute of you, Leon. Very astute of you. I was wondering if we could see the... We could see the island where we are now from across the lake at the castle. I was hoping we'd be able to see the castle across the lake in the same fashion. But we can't. Hmm. Let's get back to where we were. I feel, I've got the feeling we're about to fight Krauser. It's coming. I might do like one or two knife attacks against him. Just because I know it's supposedly good. But I'm not going to just use a knife. I want to use the mine throw, the shotgun. When was this game released? Like the the OG original Resident Evil 4. 
Because it's a very good looking game for what I assume is its time. I know I'm playing the HD Project fucking remaster mod, but but still. I, I don't mean the sharpness of the graphics, I just mean that the, the scenery, the environment is very cool for many, many years ago. I like it. For some reason it puts me in mind of Tomb Raider, and I don't know why. Maybe it's all like the ruins and stuff. <laughs> oh, this, yeah, I was gonna say, this is a boss so, arena. You two are all hooked up now, is that it? Where's Ashley? Do you really wanna know? Really, with the face paint? She's beyond that gate. It's... But you'll need three insignias Which to gate? Open. Which gate? What are you gonna do, Krauser? There's one in the north. Thanks for telling me the what to do. East. North. And let me guess. You got the last one. Oh. This is a Kratos cosplay. Means you're on a tight leash. Whoa! Time Sounds to dodge. Like thought this one out pretty well. Fucking hell, Leon's got the moves. Jesus. Fucking hell, he's jacked. Take cover real quick. Fucking hell. Right, shotgun's no good at long range. Um, fucking hell. Is, is this a Kratos cosplay with the fucking red face paint? And he's taking his shirt off. Like, any and all armor he had on, he's removed. Um. Fuck! What the fuck sort of ammunition is he using? Shit! Nope! 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 So this guy's got a mine thrower. Jesus. Is he behind me? Did he do one of his Hulk jumps? Right, this is... Okay, shotgun. He's running at me. Um, and you know what? I might be able to get to max health. I'll, set, I'll take one more hit before I use this. I should be able to take one more hit. That's what happens, motherfucker. Oh, shit. Shit! Oh, my God. That's, that's what happens, bitch. No! That, that, I don't know what I just did. Oh! Run away, run away, run away. I need some distance. Kind of. Ah! Fucking hell, he doesn't give a fuck! No! Oh, ah! 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 Right, I see. I, I kind of see that the knife might be useful, but I mean... I but I still wouldn't try a knife. This guy's so dangerous, I still wouldn't try a knife. Um, so you know what, fuck the knife. Ah. My god, this guy's a professional. Um, can I get left or right? No, Jesus. Um, let's use it. I've got so many green herbs I can make a couple of heals. Oh, he's like a whisker from full health. For no real reason, let's toss a fire nade at him. And then blast the motherfucker! Oh, mad- he, he just- <laughs> Fucking hell. He just Houdini'd out of here. So that was a timed door. I love that he told us what to do. Go to the north place, then go to the east place. He just gave us a checklist of how to defeat him, basically. Now, before we do, what's up here? Okay. I don't know if he's gone now until I go through this cage door to the next area, or if because I, like, damaged him enough, it's now timed, and I've got, like, a minute of, of respite before he comes back. Let's do this. A hundred ammo, it is. Hang on. No. Um, I forgot I... I saw the hundred bullets, I thought, uh... I thought that was the shotgun, then. No. Alright, let's do this. This, this fight will give me enough... How is that fair? How is that fair? Run! 
Look for ammo, look for ammo, look for ammo. This is what you do. I'm a professional ammo hunter. This guy truly is built like a brick shit house. I'm looking for any old shit. I think this is... Hang on, isn't this the ultimate way to go? And I've just run away. What do you intend to do restoring Umbrella? To bring order and balance to this insane world of ours. A psycho like you can't bring order or balance. Through kidnapping girls? You don't seriously think a conservative mind can chart a new course for the world, do you? I've got the piece of the Holy Beast Panther. This looks like one half of a relief to me. He did mention three things and that he has one of the three things. Oh shit. Let me just go on the map real quick as he's in my face. Have I skipped? I think I've got to fight him up here. I thought I permanently skipped the previous area then by running through in a way. Fuck it. He wants a piece of me, I'll give him a piece of me. You can't hit me with no bullshit grenades. I know this is the worst gun to be using. I know. There's no need for me no need for me to use a shotgun at that range. Professional motherfucker! Get fucked! Oh, we're talking. Come on, Bridge. Don't just stand there. Come out and fight like a man. I'm not falling for that one. Just trying to have fun. Okay. I, he dodged into that grenade. So I, you can like respond or not respond. This guy's a fucking idiot. Shall I put the uh, just for good old times? I've got four. I've only got four bullets with this, but it would be just simple fun to revolver him. But he's coming close range, so back to the shotgun. Come on, dude. I ain't scared of you. I've got the moves, Leon. You've got nothing. I'll try knifing him once. Didn't work. Did not work. Is that like an emblem thing on the floor? Is that relevant? Huh. Come at me, dude. Let's just try. F fuck it. Let's just try knifing him. Huh. I need to time this right. Nope. Okay. Ah, have we got some little puzzle? I need a head, or I can push it onto this square, which should open that. And let me go backwards. Interesting. Now it's funny. That was the first time I hit him with a knife, and I immediately won this little mini fight here, and he's gone. I wonder if just simply knifing him one time um, wins the fight. I wonder if that's why the guy said it in the comment. Or if I'd already done enough damage to him, and coincidentally, that knife was the last bit of damage I needed. Hmm. I'm curious. And on to there we go. Yes. Oh, there's two lots of unlocked doors. Good, good, good. So I've got one of the reliefs. Followed by a little boss fight. You've got to be truly jacked and like swole to take your shirt off for like a fight to the death. You've got to commend Krauser on that much, at least. 
He is clearly a badass. Ha! I mean, to be fair. To be fair. He's lost his hat. That's right, bitch. Oh, it does. Again, that might be a coincidence, but it looks like the knife attack specifically is what gets him to fuck off. I shot his hat off. Hmm. I should be able to put it on just to just to fuck with him. I was gonna say, to be fair, I reacted like a fucking soldier there. I got the first hit off. Arr! Arr! No. No. Uh, what? What? What the fuck are those things? It's such a juxta- when we see the like the futuristic-y things, like little flying robots or whatever, it's like it's such a juxtaposition to like ruins and ancient like medieval villager sort of shit. You know what I mean? One second we're like raking hay with the villagers in the farm and then you got flying robots about to self-destruct on your ass. Right, I'm so fucking lost. Let me just get my bearings. I actually need the map this time. Um, I didn't go up there. And then there's that shit there. Okay, this door will let me go down and back to where I've already been. Oh, uh, I see the little bastards on the left of the screen. Hello? Oh, they're just friendly little robot spiders. They're, it's all good. It's all good. Um, are we all reloaded? I think so. Look at the fucking herbs. Let's even make like a medium as well. In fact, just so I can say I've done it one time, let's make a triple green. Is that a full heal? Should be. Yes, it does, right. So it's a green and a red, or three greens. I'm getting so many herbs, it doesn't even matter. <laughs> Let me take yet another moment out of my busy schedule, schedule to... Um, just do a little bit of, bit of fun, bit of, bit of fun, bit of Tetris, to relieve the pressure. Oh, I've got some Magnum Um, I won't heal just yet. Right, are these things going to be friendly? Hello? Oh. No! Okay! Okay, right, uh, these things need to die before they get to you. They're weak as shit. Ooh. Five mind darts. Bloody hell. Ha! Ah! No, Mr. Frodo! No, Mr. Frodo! <laughs> okay, I thought that, I thought it was gonna chase me faster than it did. Um let's use that triple green. Voila. Rifle ammo, nice. How can it give me five, five fucking super powerful mind darts from one and then only two rifle bullets from another? That is some imbalanced shit. Oh my god, man. I'm guessing these are all Krauser's little toys. He knows how to have fun with his toys. Little robots. Is that a buried one? They fucking is, they're burying themselves! Jesus. Well, okay then. Whew, I need to end the part soon. I've been going an hour and 20 minutes. Didn't even realize the time. What is it that you fight for, comrade? My past, I suppose. I. <laughs> Umbrella. Ah! I, 
I hit. Oh! Jesus, how did that get behind me? I hit the respond key because I had a feeling that was timed, and if you didn't press the button, you would just miss the opportunity. So I don't know if I cut Krauser off by pressing it too fast. But fuck it, I don't wanna I wanna I don't wanna hear what he's gotta say anyway. Um Okay, well I've got a yellow herb again. I'll save that for later. Can't go back. Did I get everything I wanted? I think so. Let's ascend and kill this motherfucker. Or get the relief head number two. We've got the panther. I'm guessing, like, Snake comes... I bet Snake comes last because he's got, like, Snake on his knife, you know. His will be the Snake. I've got the Panther. I bet the other one's, like, an eagle or a bird. This is a hell of a battle arena. This is the best arena yet in this game. This is, this is awesome. <gasps> Fucking hell! <laughs> Not only was I correct in saying it's a bird, it's actually the exact bird I said. It's a fucking eagle. Sometimes I amaze myself with my powers of prophecy. And I bet the last one is the snake. Nice muscles, dude. Two down, one more to go, Krauser. <laughs> we'll see about that. How fucking jacked can a human get? Is this about to explain why you can jump so high? Yes, it is. Right. He's infected. Witness the power! I am You've witnessing it. Completely, Krauser. Prepare for your death, Leon. What the f why is it why is it only his arm? Oh my god, man. We gotta save three minutes! Well, let's get all the loot, because that's the most important thing. Lord knows you need the loot. Okay, 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 okay. I kind of wish I didn't have a scope in the mine thrower now. Um, because it's it takes so long to scope in and out. Let's just nade him because we can. And you know what? Let's just fucking use him. Use him! You missed. Fucking hell. You missed again. I can't even see, man. I'm trying to run past him. Oh! Fucking hell. Okay, so he's not just strong with, a, like, a blade arm. He can, like, teleport. He's so fast. Oh, there's no... Oh, I wish there was, like, a suplex option or something, but there isn't. <laughs> oh, that would be the best ending. Just fucking a simple suplex. I wish it... I wish the camera would turn. Oh! Some shit. He just immediately shields again. He didn't give a fuck, does he? Right, okay. Weapons are not helping. I need to stumble him and then I can shoot him. And this might be the time where the knife is the best and I kind of starting to see that now. Because he's just shielding himself every fucking two seconds. Shit! That didn't work. That did not work. Oh my god, I've got no health. <laughs> immediate pause, immediate heal. And I'm on full health, officially. Well, that didn't fucking work, did it? You missed. Now I'm gonna... I'm gonna shotgun this motherfucker. Ah! 
That's what happens to you, motherfucker. I need to get him to, like, open himself up. I guess he just doesn't give a fuck. Eh? The... Since when was there a ladder there? Oh, God. Okay, I just cheat. I just cheated a full reload there. Huh. Fuck, man. I mean, I'm out of, like, good grenades. Uh... I do not have time. <laughs> I don't actually need to do that. Shit! Right, you can't hit him. Okay. Good. <laughs> Goodbye, life. I tried my best. I tried my best. I just saw my game freeze and my game screen freeze though for a second. Anyway. I tried my best. Um yeah. I didn't I don't know what the fuck that ladder was that sealed up. This thing. Am I supposed to be leaving the area? Hang on. Uh I'm a bit confused here. What's going on? Why is there no fight? Have I not started the cutscene or something? Oh, I haven't picked up that shit. Right. So this that ladder is the way I came up, but it's it only sealed with like seconds left to spare. Like 30 seconds. So what's that about? What is that about? Anyway. So when he backflips, he's immortal, and you can't hit you, your bullets don't do shit. Um, grenades and that stumble him. I was getting some good shotgun shots, and I need to dodge his attacks, and then he's open. I might just try. Um, I might just try doing that. We'll see. Let's do this. Prepare for your death, Leon. <laughs> Shit! I fucking, I fucking... Oops! I failed prompt number one. Ugh. I need him to attack, come on. Attack again. Damn it. Uh, you know, I don't think I need to dodge that prompt. Un unless he does the long range attack. I think I'm good just running away from him. You see? I didn't need the I didn't need the prompt. In fact, if anything, it just wastes time. Oh shit. Oh shit. Dodge professionally. Damn it. Nice. Ooh, I need to dodge that one. Come at me, bro. Damn it, he got me. <laughs> One more hit and I'll heal. He's just straight up immortal when he's doing his flips. Shit. That was me sucking ass. I didn't miss that. Just shielded at all times. Uh, 
Right, okay, so you can't just go toe to toe with them. Sorry if my camera work is all over the fucking place. I need to do that with the camera, you see what I mean? Am I supposed to be just going downstairs? Oh, I got it! 11 seconds left to go, I got it! Leon, that's, that timer is ticking. Get fucking wrecked. Oh my god. Oh my god. Uh, it's still ticking! Cutscene! It's cutscene and it's ticking! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Um, one, two, three. I'm down though, aren't I? No! <laughs> okay, just see so just see so you're probably wondering why the fuck I ran back. I saw there was a prompt on his body to check. So I thought, oh, maybe he's got a treasure on him or something that I missed real quick. Because I didn't want to panic, jump down to safety, and I left like a hundred thousand fucking money on his body. So I thought I I didn't I just saw there was a prompt, didn't see what, what it was. So I went around, I had to go back, click on the body, and then I fucking made that. I'm calling bullshit. I fucking... Oh. I got a Steam achievement. You didn't see it, but it popped up. The ties that bind. Defeat Krauser, your former partner in battle. So, well, I mean, I'll show you. It's down there. The, the ties that bind. Defeat Krauser, your former partner in battle. So he was my former partner. Was he my police partner? And I just didn't know that. Anyway. Let's do that again. I might just skip the battle. We'll see. Um, we'll see. I might, I might chop the edit down. To the key moments. <laughs> In fact, you know what? I'm just thinking to myself. Now that I've officially defeated him, I've got the Steam Achievement for defeating the motherfucker. Okay? Officially. So, I might try the knife now, like was suggested to me. So let's break out the knife. Prepare for your death, Leon. Pre prepare for your death, motherfucker. Right, come on. Let's try knifing him, see if it is easier. Come on, dude. Ah. Jesus, that is easy. That's what I wanted. I want the prompt. Oh shit. Oh, he got me that time. <laughs> That was too far. There's no way he got me then. Come on, dude. Has he got like a 30 foot leg? Um, it wouldn't let me knife then for some reason. Okay, let's let's not be a billy arsehole. A billy bitch tits. And die. Oh, okay, so it's not that easy to knife him. It, it doesn't it doesn't let you knife during the prompt. So when that prompt appears, I couldn't knife him. Backstepping? Backstepping isn't fast enough.
You can't, you literally, you can't... Once you do the prompt, uh... Once you do the prompt, you're then locked into the animation, and the, the instant you can move again, you get another prompt, so you can't... There's no time to knife. Which is interesting. Let's restart. Prepare for your death, Leon. Oh. Okay, that ladder, you can't go down there anyway, I've just realized. Okay. Dude, with the prompts in this fight, you've got no fucking time to react at all. You are useless during the prompts. And then he's even more... You are... <laughs> I'm starting to lose my shit at this fight. It 70% of this fight is prompts. You can't do anything during the prompts. And then after the prompt, he's, Im he's immune to damage for like... Uh, during all his flips and stuff. I think, yeah. Very strange fight. I'm not sure what the proper way to kill this guy is. See, immediately after the prompt, he's immune to damage. I think that was one exception there. Shit, man. <laughs> Did I get him? Right, Jesus Christ. Oh, she did have loot. Right, oh, just the... Just the serpent thing. Right, I've got enough time to escape this time. Krauser, what happened to you? You used to be a good guy. Okay, okay. I've got a minute 13. Jesus Christ, that took me up. Let's get out of here quick. Real quick. Just, just fuck off. <laughs> um, I've still got a timer, so I'm guessing this whole area is like fucked. There's, there's nothing. Oh, there's a little bit of loot. I've got 60 long seconds. I'm good. Let's throw the pieces in. But you need a good few seconds to do this. Right, I will have edited all that out. I know, I know I will. But I've died like nine more times. I'm not kidding you. I was trying to get the knifing to work. Um, you'll have seen little bits of it, of course. I was trying to get the knifing to work and it just would not work. There seemed to be one... Uh, the biggest problem with that fight was you, you couldn't knife or shoot during a prompt. You know, when it, when it kept saying, like, press A and D, like the prompt, point blank range because I'm trying to knife him. It comes up with a prompt. I'm already in the position to knife him, but I you can't click the mouse button to, to attack. Literally nothing happens. So all I can do is hit the prompt. And then after the prompt, he becomes immune to all damage and rolls away. So I, I was I was struggling to knife him at all. Um, it is what it is. I wouldn't. I would definitely not say that was easy with a knife. Maybe if you're an, if you're an absolute pro and you know what you're doing. But I I couldn't get a knife attack off to save my life there. He just kept fucking prompting me and then rolling away. Anyway, thank fuck for that. Jesus Christ. So you need to kill him with like a good minute to spare or something. Ooh, Jesus. This is the biggest yes to a save prompt I ever saw. I ain't doing that shit again. That was, a t that was the toughest thing in this game yet. That was some hard shit. And there he goes exploding behind me. Right. Um, oh, I suppose in good news, uh, I don't think I used a single heal in that last attempt, so I've got all my heals back again, like magic. Let's use the full one and get to true full health.
Nice. Let's uh, let's make him. You know what? Let's make a full. I've got two full heals. That was one of the harder boss fights I've ever had. Just through lack of availability of when you could attack him, he was like immune all of the time. When his shield was up, he was immune. When he was flipping backwards, he was fully immune. Your bullets couldn't land. When you were within point blank range, he was prompting you, forcing you to be up at absolutely useless except pressing the prompt. You, that's the worst thing about the prompt. You can't do anything except hit the prompt key. If you could ignore the prompt key and take some damage while you hit him, that's a whole other thing. But the whole prompt system, the QTEs, you make you useless unless you pr press them. Mm. Well, I showed him who was boss. So, anyway, let's ignore the fucking tough fight. I bested the motherfucker. Um, he, so, it turns out he he took on the Plaga shit to his own body. And he started to, like, mutate. He had a, bla a blade arm, but nothing else. So, it seems you killed Krauser. Too. Yes, I did. Are you starting to shit your pants? Appreciation. What are you talking about? I thought he was with you. <laughs> what are you talking about? Yeah, Leon, come on. Do you really think I'd trust an American? To tell you the truth, I was contemplating how to get rid of him. But thanks to you, that's no longer necessary. You were just You're welcome. Him from the start. Oh, I must hand it to you. We knew this already, Leon. You demonstrated quite a bit of promise by killing Krauser. A little bit of promise. When your assimilation with Las Plagas is complete, I'll have you serve as my guard. Wanna bet, bitch? Unfortunately, I'm gonna have to decline your generous offer. I'ma kill you. I have prior engagements. <laughs> Enjoy your smart mouthing. Leon what does have the smart mouthing. Leon loves his smart mouth with his one-liners. <laughs> Los Illuminados. Is this vi is that a minigun? Plus rocket launchers. Okay, this is like headquarters of the Los Illuminados. Damn. I've got a scoped rifle. about time. Who's this? Sorry, bad traffic. I'll cover you. Cool! Can I call on his help? Dude. Okay. I just need you to, like, bomb the minigun guy and I'm good. What the fuck? What the fuck, man? Jesus. Whatever works, I guess, but hell. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Damn. Merciless. Who the fuck is piloting this? What legend is in this chopper? Now that's what I call backup. Her name's Mike. You're looking for firepower, you come to the right place. You ain't kidding. Firepower. Right, you know what? I, is the save point still here? I've just realized how long this episode is. I need to end the, end the episode, so let's... let's. I should have ended it before. <laughs> One last save. And let's stop the episode here. Jesus. I thought I'd have to fight a village of, you know, a village headquarters full of the most powerful villagers. Rocket launchers, miniguns. Nope, the chopper just breezes over like a fucking, like a water tower, but with like gasoline in it. I was going to say, that is not safe operation of a, of a helicopter. <laughs> Helicopters don't ram into things. It, shit doesn't work like that. <laughs> Unless you're looking to... If I can crash the chopper. So so Mike, with his firepower, is one hell of a pilot. I'm hoping we can sort of call on him to, like, call airstrikes in next episode. That'll be awesome. 
Anyway, thanks for joining me for this part. We've, we've had trials and tribulations. We've had easy boss fight with the with the legs and the scorpion head. And then we've had super fucking, in contrast, we've had super fucking hard boss fight with Krauser. I wouldn't be surprised if Krauser was the toughest boss in this game. And like Lord Sadler soon is probably just like a pussy in comparison. But jeez, hope you enjoyed watching me get my ass handed to me before... The, C the timer in the C4 was the problem. I could have just just kept running away from Krauser. But he was smart. He put me on a fucking time limit. <laughs> like this video if you liked it. Like this video if you didn't like it. And catch me in the next episode. Which, I don't know. It could end up being the final episode. Shit is really coming to a head here. We've killed like his right hand dude. There's only Lord Sadler left. Villagers and Lord Sadler. So, next episode might be the final one. Hope you've enjoyed it. Subscribe for similar content if you haven't already. Uh, yeah, I've got a Twitch channel for live streams if you want to see me live playing some random games. And I've got a Patreon if you want to go above and beyond to support my content and keep the content flowing. There is always that option. Links in the description to everything, including Discord. So, catch me on one of those many social medias. Liquid Blitz. Out. Out.